We have, Byron. So we were sitting here and the birds were alarm calling. So we sat for a while and we looked and we saw where the birds were jumping around. And there, perched high up in a knobthorn amongst the knobthorn flowers, is a beautiful little pearl spotted owlet. Now it's all puffed up and is all fluffy, and that's why it looks larger than it actually is. When it flattens all of that out, it will be a much smaller bird but it's amazing how if you just stop for two seconds when you hear something out of place when you hear birds making that spishing sounds that psh, 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 then you know that something's not right and generally when they make that sound it's either for an owl and these big punch in and show all of you but there we go so you can see it blends quite well and that's even really punched in its coloration is actually quite good to blend in with those little cream flowers as well look at that how difficult can it, you can see how difficult it is to actually see them now Elena you want to know if there's a difference between an owl and an owlet well Elena it's just the size so our owlets are our tiny little ones so they're all the small owls that weigh close to a hundred grams and then our owls proper are all the bigger ones that are much larger than that so owlets get the name just because of their very small size and off it goes flying into the distance there it's been tired of being shouted at by various different birds and so it's going to go find somewhere else to camouflage don't worry senzo it's flown away now but that was very cool what a nice surprise to see it's really